Hey guys, welcome back to another video where today we're going to be going over everything you need to know about the module rework and the leak box rework. So we're just going to come in here and explain everything. I'm going to claim my 10,000 free modules that you need to get on and claim. I'm also going to claim this for the new battle crate rework. And then we're going to come click through all these ads. Oh, hold on. What was that ultimate? What was that ultimate thing? Guys, I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted. There's so many of these. Oh my god. Come on. Stop it. Okay, let's go see what that was real quick. I'm pretty sure it's in here. Okay, yeah, it is. Ultimate data pad. They, they're basically giving you a free ultimate data pad, but the cost is I can't, um, I can't, like, upgrade anything. So what's even in here? I'll decide if this is worth it or not. Ooh, an ultimate glory would be insane. An ultimate ion would be decent. I don't really care about the Orkin, and the ultimate squall, squall would be pretty bad. The ultimate invader would be pretty good. I would definitely use that. But I don't think I'm going to, because... There's only three or five things in here that I would actually like like to get, and I'm not willing to take that risk. Okay, back to the topic, though. We have six of these. So, let's get down to explaining how the modules work, okay? So, if we come in here into our Titan or Robot, it doesn't matter. We see this right here, not like any button at the top, top of it where it used to be, but it's at the bottom under the weapons. And now, we have to unlock all this stuff right here to get to the main part of it. So, so a cheap way to do this is to just, once you unlock this, click on this and keep just keep unlocking. And then, you get to select a specialization. I'm going to upgrade this real quick, though. Oh, my goodness. Give me that singular reactor. Okay. Okay, so there's attack, defense, and brawler. So, Brawler is going to give you increased health and speed. Attack is going to give you more damage, and Defense is just going to give you a lot more health. And maybe, like, some defense points. I think... Let me think. Well, Heimdall's definitely not a Brawler. It's kind of... I think it's more of a damage dealer, kind of. I think... Um... Hmm... I think I'm going to go defense for now. Well, hold on. Titan Fortifier? What is this? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. And then Titan Heavy Armor Kit? Yo, that's a lot of extra durability. Holy. Oh, we can actually see what we can get, so we can see what would be best. Okay, that's actually awesome. Very happy that they did that. Antimatter and Onslaught. Those are, those are insane. Antimatter reactors, 19% more damage. Onslaught is 15% more damage. That's not even upgraded either, by the way. Titan repair ramp. And then Titan anti-control. Um, I actually changed my mind. I think I'm going to go brawler. What? Okay, there we go. I can... You, if you, you have to click the check mark, and I couldn't figure it out. Okay, so let's buy these. I guess Brawler's going to be the best for this, so I can stay alive longer. Okay. We're going to take the Titan Repair Amp first. We're going to fully upgrade this as well. So I'm, oh, boy. It costs 1200 to fully upgrade that for the passive module on a Titan. It's fine, though. This gives that and then self fix 20,000 a second hold on that might be decent uh but that's what the repair amps for hmm I'm, I'm just gonna upgrade it for now anyway and then test it out later all right there we go here's a fully set up thing all right we're five out of five on that now so it's perfect it's all done now okay let's go 
Let's go do it on one of these robots. And I'm only going to do it on one that I know for sure I'm going to continuously use. Also known as this by who links. So let's go in here and see what it looks like for here. Okay, so let's just start upgrading. Also, I'm going to say this again. If you want to save microchips, just unlock everything like I'm doing now. And then I go upgrading later. Because if you get it, it's going to be better. Alright, let's upgrade these though. I definitely want the extra damage there. And then for this, I'll just, I'll, I guess, I'll take Unstable Conduit. Ugh, that's, a, that's expensive though. So I think I'll just keep Repair Unit for now. Okay, Saboteur. I'm not sure what that means. Beacon Operator? Yo! Increase Beacon Capture Speed by 10%? That's actually insane. Dude, this might be, like, crazy. Overdrive unit. And cloaking unit. Okay, what is what is the defense give? Fortifier, anti-control, fortifier, heavy armor. Okay, okay, that's not it at all. Pierce unit, what is that? Oh, it gives you a little bit of defense mitigation. Not a lot, though. Not enough to matter. Wait, can you not even get the nuclear amp amplifiers anymore? I don't know. I kind of want to... kind of want to get this beacon operator. I feel like that would be really good. I'll try it out. It doesn't cost an absolutely horrible amount to do these, so... I'll definitely try it. I'm going to get Robot Accelerator first. Oh! Oh my god, I forgot you could even upgrade these. Dude, so now this the Robot... It increases by 11... And then the beacon operator increases beacon capture by 15%. That's insane. Plus we get 3% speed, or 3 speed right there. And then we can choose between cloaking unit. And then overdrive unit. I think I'm going to choose overdrive, actually. But maybe not. I don't know. Okay, so cloaking unit is going to last for 6 seconds. How this thing gives me 20% more damage, though, so I think I'm definitely going to take that. And that's even more speed. Dude, I'm going to be so fast with this Lynx, it's actually going to be crazy. Okay. I think I'm going to save the rest of them. Okay, now that I've gone over that, I'm going to go over the rework for these. And as you can see, I'm in Champion League. Shame on you for the comments that don't think I'm in Champion League. I am in Champion. Okay, enough of that though. So these give booster modules and silver. Very happy to see that if you play battles you can just earn them. This this gives thorium, platinum, and gold. All good. This And the final one gives the gold resource boosters. Dude, there's actually a way to get them now. No way. And it gives microchips a decent amount of them in memoriam. So literally, if you just grind the game for a ton of time, you can get a bunch of materials to upgrade your stuff. So this is actually really nice. I think it's as simple as that. You just play battles, get as much armor points to get these chests, and you get these rewards. Alright, I actually, that's actually, oh, that's actually a really good update. Because it allows you to get pretty much every resource I think free to play as well it just takes some time which I mean everything takes time so it's fine and the rewards obviously get better the higher league you get so we can see it silver there's like you, you're getting modules already of course and then champion league you're getting like maximum stuff okay so that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments, and I'm sure I'll be able to explain them. Okay. If, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Otherwise, if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and uh, bye!